Okay guys, so what you'll need is some wooden rectangles. I just got mine from Michael's in the wood section. You'll need a pencil, a fine tip paint brush, any color of your choice, white and black to mix the colors together. So to achieve this final look here, you want to grab your pencil and your wooden block and you want to mark a vertical line on the right hand side and on the left hand side and then you want to mark a horizontal line on the left and on the right hand side and for the middle section of the stone you want to just round off the corners and here I'm just making everything a little more darker just defining it so that I don't lose it when I paint it again everything is preference you could make anything thicker or thinner uh, depending on how you want the final look to look like Okay guys, so for color number one, it's the lightest green. This consists of two white dots and one green dot. And this is going to go on the outer section on the left hand side of the block. And you're just gonna wanna fill it in um, as even and as dark as possible. I know it's a little hard to get right into the lines, but I promise you, the more you get into this, the, the easier it will be. So again, this is the lighter green that you'll be marking on the left hand side of the block. So for color number two, this consists of one white dot and one green dot. And this is a little darker and you're gonna wanna mark the two left corners, the upper corner and the lower corner on the left hand side of the block. And again, just try to get the corners and make it as even as possible. Um, you can dilute the paint a little bit to make it a little smoother. So for color number three, this is just the plain green color and this is going to go right in the middle. This isn't mixed with anything, this is straight from the tube. Um, I did have to add a little bit of white to make it more of an emerald green. But other than that, uh, this is straight from the tube. And again, this color is going to go right in the middle of your block. Okay guys, so we're almost done. This dark green consists of one black dot and one green dot mixed together. And you're gonna wanna apply this color on the top and lower middle section of the block. Okay guys, we're almost finished. What you want to do to achieve this beautiful dark green color is mix two black dots and one green dot together. Grabbing your paintbrush, you want to mark the upper right hand corner of the block and the lower right hand corner of the block. Okay guys, for the final color, this one is the darkest green, almost black. 
you want to grab it and you want to paint the right hand side of the block with this dark green color. I'm grabbing the second color that we used and mixing it in with the fifth color because I felt like the fifth color was a little too dark but once I did this it looked perfect and it made the block look a lot more even and the colors a lot closer to what it would look like if this was a real um, stone. Grabbing a paintbrush a little larger, I'm grabbing the darker color that we used, the final color, and I'm painting the edges um, to make it look like a shadow around the stone. So here's the final product. This is what it's supposed to look like depending on what colors you use, uh, but I am very satisfied with the outcome. What I did was I also added a chain to it to make it into a necklace. Of course, you guys could turn it into whatever you'd like. I hope you guys enjoyed my DIY and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.